you realize we're talking about going up against the most powerful guy in all of Rio? Yes, we are. Then we're going to need a team. For this film, the objective was to bring in characters that you knew from other Fast and Furious films, put them all together, and have a lot of fun. When are you going to give Martin Luther King his car back? As soon as you give Rick James his jacket back. This time around, there's no way we could have even thought about venturing out without bringing everyone back. Everyone has played a major part, and everyone has contributed a whole hell of a lot to this franchise that's been involved in it. Here we go, baby, let's go! I'm gonna be genuine and say this. I am just genuinely, genuinely happy to be back. <laughs> too Fast, Too Furious is my second movie. I mean, I was in the movie with the whitest white man ever, Mr. Paul Walker. This is a straight surfer dude, blonde, blue-eyed. What's going on, dude? What's happening, dude? Where are you, dude? I love that guy. He's a true rock star. This dance right here is for Paul. You ready? We have so many stars, so many actors. It's incredible. We have such a good chemistry, and it's fun. This is Vin Diesel, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Don't you love him? It's like we went to high school together. It's like in the old gang back together. Yeah, usually the, the, the cars are the stars of the movie, but on this one, because we have this huge ensemble, it's allowing us to kind of think out of that box and kind of stretch that muscle. Usually you see characters for like two hours and then you're out of their lives. And with us, you know, you get to see them expand for 10 years. When things started out, we were all just a bunch of kids and we're really happy to be there. Now we've had a franchise that has spanned a decade. We're pretty lucky. Beyond that, I think we we're really lucky. It was just in assembling a cast that's so big that we all get along the way that we do. The energy here is warm and generous. It's like going back home and you know, seeing relatives that you haven't seen in a while. The most important thing in life will always be the people in this room. Definitely a theme on and off screen, the theme of family. You know that old saying, family comes first. So yes, it has been great. Uh, we've been hanging out with the cast, Offset, and I mean, you know, everybody's friends, it's good energy. Can I get some light? Thank you, sir. See, this is what friends are for. This is what I'm talking about, man. This is my friend, like real friends, you know what I'm saying? This is the, when you, when a friend is in need, this is the type of, you just come off the top, man, like, you know what I mean? Well, you know, He's resourceful, it's, extremely resourceful. It's whatever it takes to get it done. As long as you don't get on that joint looking like Barry White's cousin. <laughs> oh, don't worry about that, brother. People always talk about how, you know, we're like one big happy family and it's so cliche. I mean, nine times out of 10, I don't buy it. I mean, you come and hang out as a visitor in our set and you'll see the dynamic. It's the real deal. You can't create that, that's just luck of the draw. Careful, learn how to drive. Yeah, let me get this over here. This is what it's all about, my friend. We're all having a little too much fun. It's almost a crime to actually get paid and to have this much fun. This is all real money. This is really not a problem. This is actually Ben's safe and his money. He's a method actor. What can we say? <laughs> this is what he got for the, the movie The Pacifier. Ah. All right here in the book. <laughs> I don't care what mood you was in. I don't care what bad news you got before you got to this set. When you get on the set of Fast Five, it's a party. And now to sing the national anthem, Mr. Paul Walker. It's fun because we each have different ways of, of interacting with the boys. I mean, Tyrese is very playful and he's always kidding around on set. And it's just very testosterone filled. But on the other hand, that's really fun and they're all good looking guys. It's, you know, it's a very easy day at work. We're a bunch of grown men playing pretend with just bigger toys. So there doesn't need to be an ego. I think if you can step back and look at it that way, you know, this is a gift. And when you're at home sitting up watching this DVD, I just need y'all to know that even though we're all paid to be here, we worked our asses off to make this the best Fast and the Furious you've ever seen. So we just hope you enjoy. Mm. Fast and the Furious. Ah, five. <laughs> yeah.